Um, just to give you an idea, the when we do heart catheterizations, heart catheterizations used to go through the femoral artery. Patients would have to lay flat for a few hours. There's a big bleeding risk. Now I'd say 90 plus percent, I go through the radial artery, through their wrist, and patients right after a heart catheterization, they sit right up, they can eat a tuna sandwich, they go home right away. Not only that, uh, if you look, the stuff that we're able to do through little holes in arteries, we, we've obviated the need for open heart surgery, and patients who have an aortic valve replaced used to have to be in the hospital for a week. Now they go home the next day. I, last week, two 90-year-old patients had their aortic valve replaced, and then they're home by lunchtime the next day, which I, I can't tell you how cool that is when you compare in the room next to them. They have younger patients with all these chest tubes coming out and all this stuff from open heart surgery. But I mean, if you, if you go that way, by the time you go into the field, you're gonna look back at this interview and laugh at me because man, that guy was such a barbarian. He had to poke someone's femoral artery to replace their aortic valve. Now I give them a pill and they're good. You know, so that, that's the cool part of the job, I think.